You just shouldn't be able to take it from someone and keep it. The last time we spoke with Sandy Steiner, she was fighting to get her money back, the $167,000 she'd given to Kingswood, a senior living center on Warnell Road. Steiner's actually never lived at Kingswood. She changed her mind before ever moving in. Despite that, more than a year later, she still hasn't gotten her refund. Kingswood said under the terms of the contract she signed, she'll have to wait until it rents her apartment. Well, here's the good news. Kingswood, which filed bankruptcy after this story aired, was ordered by a judge to give Miss Steiner most of her money back, $150,000. But the battle continues for another senior. I think it's unethical for them to keep that. Carolyn Coleman is talking about Aberdeen Village in Olathe. She stopped living there in August 2020 and moved in with her daughter and son-in-law. She's been waiting for her $107,000 refund ever since. And just like with Miss Steiner, her contract contract stipulates that Aberdeen doesn't have to give her money back until it rents her apartment. But, you know, we have no control over whether or not they rent the apartment. Aberdeen's director, Tim Allen, had told Problem Solvers months ago that he thought Ms. Coleman had waited long enough for a refund and would try to get her one. Unfortunately, Mr. Allen was unable to make that happen. Aberdeen's corporate marketing director said refunds have been delayed because far fewer seniors have moved into the complex since COVID hit. She assured us that as soon as the apartment is rented, Miss Coleman will get her money back. So for Miss Coleman, who is 89 years old, this problem is yet to be solved. She has now hired an attorney. Linda Wager, Fox 4 Problem Solvers.